Well, hello everybody, and welcome back to our Let's Play Wasteland 3! Supernova Tiffy sitting over there. Say hi! Hi! I'm Ava Toby sitting here. Say hi! Hi! This is episode, I think we're on 16. Okay. We just were in that other area above, weren't we? And um, tried to rescue the hostages. I don't think we really did. We kind of, they kind of already pre burnt and all that stuff, but at least it wasn't our fault. So we come back here now. Oh, don't we? Oh, don't we need to go to tell them what happened? Mm-hmm. Uh, are you already heading there? No, because I don't remember how to get there. What? Stop with my wife? What? Huh? Ew! Did I? Mm-hmm. I don't get anything that used to. Okay, that was, that was a female voice now. Okay, what do male voices just from them two? Talking about his flagpole don't stand, they're all females. I'm confused. Mm -hmm. Okay, so where do we want to... Market Square... Cassidy's Fine Clothes... Marshall Station, isn't it? Can I click it? Oh, it's got a star there. What the? I don't know. Okay, I just got pulled over here, what? Are we we're near it? Oh, you went two walls on. Let me listen. Hello. Okay. Who are you? I am the humble son of scientists. My mother and father were on a mission to pursue the possibility of cold fusion. Imagine nuclear reactions at room temperatures making it safe for everyone. Felix just poking the thing repeatedly is not actually doing anything to it. They are gone, and my efforts to follow their work has been stymied by immediate dangers. Perhaps one day I'll have the time to devote to such a monumental achievement again. Okay. What about Colorado Springs Wall? It's simply your standard concrete barrier with Tesla styled electrical deterrence. Hmm, the standard one. Marvel of what could be done, but sufficient for the task of keeping out enemies. Okay. If we had oil to power the generators, you'd see the glorious effect of thousands of volts of electricity arcing across it, deterring would be attackers from approaching. Such Can we fix this? <laughs> Now, they need to get this quicker, the talker. Thank you for stopping by, and good luck out there. Right to the wall. Is there anything we can interact with with the wall to help? Door. No time. Uh, this isn't the wall. This is a house. No. I think he means the whole wall thing he's messing with. And Becker in a lab coat, lab coat. This doctor's clearly weary, but works feverishly to bandage the body, head, bloody head, bloody head of an unconscious young hey, woman. Doc. Oh, Quan, I hope you won't take offense, but I've got no time. Oh, did you see that blood just spurt the back? Mm -hmm. Look at my screen. It's, fa oh, it's fading now. Oh, blood spurted out of him there. Mm. It just faded. Wait there again. Do you see it? Oh wow! Okay, watch again. They might ever keep doing it. Let's see if it does it again. It did it quite quick last time. You gonna do it? Does it look? Hmm. Like, why is he just splitting blood? Is he on yours? No. Because <laughs> it's that guy right there, right? Yeah. Hope you won't take offense, but I've got a time for niceties. Dying people take. Well, the guy split literal <laughs> behind me. <laughs> To help. Gestures toward the injured patient lying nearby. The spurting one. <laughs> and I don't have the time or tools to save them. What's because you're busy talking to us? Barter requirement not met. You can count on us. What can we do? Yeah, I guess it's that. Hopefully we can heal him. Top Doc. Find and return supplies to Dark Park or at the clinic in downtown Clara Springs. Thank you. The things I need most are a suture kit. 
an injury kit and a medic pack. Got that? Don't we have a lot? These folks are literally dying on us, so don't fuck around. Wow! Don't we already have that? Uh, we're on it. We've already got the kits you want. Yes, that one. Great. Then get started on those patients. Press aid. Got it. Top doc. Adium added. What's Adium? He nods, allowing to quiet sigh of relief, then returns his attention to the injured woman. I think this guy needs it the most. Well, yeah! <laughs> He's splurting blood! Clenching his teeth in a puddle of his own blood. Literally. A hand pressured on his belly. What's that? In intestines. Pressed on his belly. From between the slates of his fingers. He won't last much longer without help. If you use one of your suture kits on him, he may be able to save his life. Bad, is it? Just flesh wound. Am I right? You should see. There's an injury kit. Or is it something called suturing kick? Because you said suture, not injury. Do we have one? So injury kits. Suturing kits, we do. Yeah. Bad, is it? Just flesh wound. Oh, I can't. It needs first aid one. Who's got first aid one? I thought all of us. Yeah, I thought we all did. That's not Sir Dave, though. Or yours. That's mine! Oh, uh, Yes, he's my medical guy. Oh, but Sir Dave can actually use it and he can't. Okay. Okay. I'm using it. That's the last of them. You Let's round him up wound. and bring him back to Doc Parker. This. That's the last of them. It's the only one we did. So have we done the mission? Or have we got to do everyone? Yeah. The woman is almost unconscious. Her body in a nightmare of bruises and welts. But at least she's breathing. Oh, so to her too. The damage is severe, but treatable with basic tools. You can use one of your medic packs to save her life. Medic packs. Why wouldn't they stop? No one on my group's got a medic pack on them. I'm carrying one. Okay, how do you do it? I'm gonna do this one. If you, you put it in the bell, yeah, and then click on them. Where? What's going on? Did you patch me up? Okay, so this one. Hello? This man doesn't appear to be in much pain, but he's intensely focused on his leg. White bone shears through the skin. He's clearly broken in several places. This may end poorly for him. You could use one of your injury kits to save his life. You got that. Escape the Dorseys. Didn't count on the ground stopping me. Hmm. Count on the ground stopping you. Well, that's how it works. My leg. You said it. Yep. Still hurts like a bitch. Maybe I'll actually walk again. This young woman that was unconscious, her head is wrapped in body gauze. Bloody wasn't it again. Why do you think body was is bloody? Alright. Goodbye. Good luck. So what do you need for him? I don't think we can. Yeah, well. No? For anyone else? Make sure you take care of that bike when you get to it. That rust trap. Oh, that's to dot then to tell him we're doing it. We've done them that way. We've done everything we can for the patients. They should all pull through. We have a few questions. Any chance you're interested in working for us? We could use a doctor at our headquarters. Ooh, let's tell them the first thing first. The patient one. Good. Thank you. Oh, we got a stethoscope. I know I've asked a lot of you. Oh, now what? What? Oh, level. She was shot in the head. What girl? There's no exit wound. The bullet's still in there. What girl? I need to keep constant watch on her. I guess and I need cleaner, safer facilities to do it. Oh, our place. Yeah. If you let me use the facilities at your HQ. I'll, Yay! I'll do anything. Oh yeah. I'll work as your doctor. I'll fucking juggle for you, Rangers. Oh okay. I just need to save her. What do you say? I'm going to say you're going to be a juggling doctor. Welcome aboard. 
We don't need a doctor. We need to think about it. We're going to board Dark. Thank you. Thank you. You saved her life. And mine. Need anything before I get my stuff together? You could juggle for us, like you said. So medical attention. Not now. Yeah, medical attention. I don't know if we've been here or not. Of course. Let's have a look. Good luck. Okay, I should have healed us. No. Okay, so he's gonna work for us now. Jimmy Longhall. Oh. Hello, Jimmy Longhall. Evening. In his old age. Even in his old age, sorry. This man is impressive. Broad shouldered and thick necked. He wears his hair in thick white braids. Hey, Jimmy. Hey, Jimmy. Dorsey's didn't get this far. They were after folks wearing badges like yours. I would have shot those Dorsey's dead if they walked in my garage. Of course, you would. I haven't seen your friends before. You folks are looking for help with your vehicle. Come to the right place. Well, we're already doctors, so maybe we can help with mechanic your stuff too. What is this place? I'm gonna go with garage. This is the Colorado Springs Arapahoe Station. We got stations all over Colorado, mostly for fixing and supplying our own fleet. But we fix vehicles and sell parts to anybody. Anybody? Even Dorsey's? I'm the manager, Jimmy Longhall. That's my crew over there. If you need any repairs or alterations to your ride, they're the ones who will put it all together. Oh, cool. Best crew in the business. It's like you're also through pair people. Pair people? Yeah? Oh, that's Doc Parker. He needed a place to set up his clinic. We had the space, so good thing too. Those Dorseys hurt a lot of people in a little raid of theirs. We brought as many as we could in here. Doc's been patching them up as fast as he can. Only got two hands though. Probably a good doctor. The best in Colorado Springs. The best, no the life. best, the best. He was the patriarch's now personal ours. physician for a while. Mm. Took care of all the hoity toits and brought hoity toits. Kind of pissed us off at the time, actually. Mm. Nice Arapaho boy taking care of the hemorrhoids of a hundred families, turning his back on his own people. Oh, he's going with us now, too, so he's doing it again. <laughs> Remembered who he was and set up his clinic here. Huh? He's, He's leaving. Been serving the working people of Colorado Springs ever since. You see it over here, our last conversation with him. <laughs> you tell us about your please. Co workers, not employees. I only give the orders because I take the orders. Get me? Yeah. Anyway, Fastback's the old one. Been with the station almost as long as I have. Who is Chevron? That's a Dave. But he's the most sentimental sap you oh. ever meet. And Pacer is our newest recruit. Don't mess with her. She's ten pounds of attitude in a five-pound bag. Mm. Mm. So are you all? App what that word is? Upper something here? Upper awful? At the moment? Yeah, I guess so. Great, right, because I don't know what it meant. <laughs> Driving and fishing has kind of become the Arapaho brand. Arapaho. Arapaho. Arapaho, not Arapaho. Arapaho. Uh, being the best mechanic is encouraging the rest. You tell me about the Arapahoes. Well, except for those of us who run the stations. Station. Mostly live on the road. The road. The people of the convoy. Folks call it. We turn that way of life into a business. Arapaho service stations, Iron Thunder Logistics, Arapaho Caravan Protection, and so on. All right, then. folks were eating each other in the suburbs or were fighting over mansions in Broadmoor Heights. Mm. We kept to the wildlands and didn't come back until civilization ended. That was called that. I'm a middle person. And when we came back, 
We came with services people needed. Transportation, protection, and repair. Been living well ever since. Do you hire us? Should we the episode there? Oh. I'll just ask them. There's not one that listen there, so I'm sure. Sure we do. If they're good enough, it takes a lot of skills to be better than an Arapaho. Arapaho! I guess we got to what sell quick and What'd you sell? Anything for your vehicle. Have a look. Have a look. You don't have much, you said anything. It's a repair kit, a rhino cannon, a chucker horn, and a tool kit. Do Did you say a chocolate horn? A tool kit! No, I mean a chucker horn. A trucker horn. I said a trucker horn. A trucker horn. Yeah, a trucker horn, that's what I'm saying. It sounds like you're saying a chucker horn. I'm not saying a chucker horn, I say a chucker horn. Chuckle horn. Chuckle horn. That's what you're saying. It's exactly, a chuckle horn. A truck horn. A trucker horn. Chuckle horn. <laughs> no, stop making fun of me. It's a chuckle horn. It's not a chuckle horn. It's a chuckle horn. We can upgrade our horn. Apparently, we can upgrade our weapon. We can have a quick slot repair kit, and we have a cool tip. A, co a cool tip. Oh my god. Cool kit. Two kit. Not a two tit. A cool <laughs> tit. tit. A two kit. Cool tit. Tool oh kit. my god! Tool kit! Tool kit! Oh my Tool god! Tool kit! And you say, I'm bad! Like a rope model. I'm trying to say something like, we got a tool tit! Tool kit! Anyway, like, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Tune in next time. I've been Avatopia. That's been. Super Nutter Bye everybody! I forgot to do this with my hat.